I wanted to quickly show you how to restore things that have been hidden in the mobile view. So um, we have some text here on this page. Uh, let's go back to the desktop. And it has the who we are text here. Um, but this got uh, uh, hidden by mistake on mobile. So it's actually really easy to restore it. Let's go over to the mobile editor. And now we can come over here to hidden on mobile on this left hand side. Um, and you'll see there's there's all these hidden um, objects. A lot of these things we do not need to unhide, but this text, this is what got hidden. Um, it's very easy to accidentally hide things because when you click on items, uh, a lot of times there is a little hide thing. And if you hit if you hit this icon, it just disappears from your page. But it doesn't mean that it's gone forever. You can actually restore it by just coming over here to hidden elements and then hit show. What that will do is it will put that text back here on the page and then you can space it accordingly and get it, uh, you know, to have it where you want it as desired. So um, that's just a little quick tool. If you ever lose an element on your on your mobile site, it's very easy to restore it. Just come over to hidden and find that element and restore it again. Don't restore these container boxes. They were being used on the desktop and not really being used in the um, in the mobile view. So don't worry about those. And then same thing with this column. This is in the header. We don't want to do that either. So just make sure you're restoring the one that you want. If for whatever reason you you show something and you don't want it, you can always rehide it too by clicking on that element and hiding it from the site. Again, this will not affect your desktop version. Um, basically, the mobile view of Wix sites is just all your same elements from your desktop being shown in a mobile layout. Um, and so if you hide them, it doesn't change anything on the desktop. It just changes it on desktop. A few other little tips. If you want to make the size of the font bigger or smaller, you can use these A plus or A minuses. You can also change the alignment of the text or even the color. Um, you can also change the size here. And what that does is it will affect this mobile view, but it will not affect your desktop view. So just a, a quick tool um, to keep that uh, uh, good. <laughs> Another thing, a couple other little tools that you can use too are like these drag handles. So if you want to make some space or space things out better, uh, you can use these. You can also drag things around manually, but you'll see that they may overlap if you don't use the drag handles. That will actually move everything up and down in sync with it, which is nice. But it's always good to double check, scroll down and, and go through all these, make sure that everything is looking as expected, um, and then make sure you hit publish when you're done. So let me know if you have any other questions, but hopefully this answers quickly answers uh, the question about that missing text that got hidden. Uh, and again, those are all located here. And you can bring them back or hide them at, at will, basically, in the mobile view, and it will not affect desktop. Happy Wixen!